building. My grandfather has a lot of history that not many people know about. Is that the farm? He grew up on this farm and he was born under this tree in the middle of the farm. It was, it was under that oak tree, the house was, but the oak tree wasn't tall enough to have anything under it. I'm 31, but my brothers were born, uh, Virgil was five years before me and he was born in the other location over there. My grandfather, my grandfather uh, owned that land. And you see the, the woods there. Uh, that's the, right at the property line for this, for this farm. Okay. And from there on, and this is where my grandfather, where my father was born. And Wow. And he sold his farm to the Andersons who lived north of the uh, about three quarters of a mile, I guess. And they, uh, and they own that now. The house he grew up in is still there. Um, some of the sheds that were already, have been there forever are still there. He still has um, two trailers. <laughs> that he had with my grandma that are still there. This, drive, this driveway my father made. Did he? And he hauled gravel out of the ditch there. We used to, in the earlier years, but yeah, the driveway over there. We moved in a while. Uh, just uh, while I was in high school, uh, the house Dad built had that big shed built. I had that one and the one over there. Much, much later. Oh, we've got at least one bowl here. <laughs> yeah, there's two of them. There's one inside there, too. I don't think the one inside is a bowl. I think it's a cow. They wouldn't put two bowls out like that, would they? There's been a, the last time I was here, there were seven of them. When I was a kid, no one really told me what my my history was, what my culture was, and farming is something on both sides of my family. They grew cattle and they grew feed and corn to feed them. This Horses and pigs. Is it oh. And in uh, my in in my uh, high school years, Glenn and I had sheep. That's where we put up the netting fence. My dad and I put the netting fence up. <clears throat> okay. It was just wires before that. That hole in cows. Gotcha. No. I I rented to my neighbors the Andersons. It really fascinates me how passionate he is about his land and what he wants to accomplish with it, what he wants to work on when he's there. You know, it's just a matter of what you prefer. Do you prefer to have a lot of people around and tight, or do you, do you go far distances without uh, I love you, Grandpa. Thank you for sharing your story with me.